Thought Creeper here. Welcome to another video. Right now, I am currently exiting the shrine that I just finished in the last episode. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. And let's continue trying to conquer Von the Boris. So, we need to talk to this guy right here. Ask him if he's fine. He. I want to see who's going mm. to Gerudo Town. And now we just need to teleport back to here. Which is easy enough. Hmm. I did not actually know that about cooking. Legend of Zelda. Okay. Okay. Now all we need to do is head to the top and talk to the guy up there. Sir, mm. um. study his face. Mm. I can literally see his face all hair. Oh, man. Mm. Okay, that is not right one. Oh. Mm. oh, okay, just the top two. Mm. Take it. Not even that big of a oh. dent in my wallet. Actually, it's about 50%. But not that bad. And now we have Lady Link. Or Linkle. Whoa! Mm. <laughs> oh. mm. Yeah, yes, yes. And the wind knocks off his oh. face mask. And Link is very annoyed. See, mm. annoyed. <laughs> now all I have to do is head to Gerudo Town. Wow, that looks really cool teleporting. This is why I had, I did, I went and um, go grab the travel medallion because it makes this little part so much easier. And all we need to do is scale this wall. We are in. Okay, I think it's the air. Yep, this is the arrow merchant. Take them all, because I need arrows. And then the Grudo Secret Club is down here. I just equipped Bond of Wars again. Oh. G. Oh. C. Mm -hmm. G S C. Diamond. Oh. Yes. That right. Oh. Yes, yes, I know. First time in here. Oh. Whoa, that stuff is expensive. Ah. Should I Hey, can I sell some stuff? What is this place? <laughs> Not what I want to ask. Oh. Okay. I have to sell all my screws. I want at least the. <laughs> well, actually, I have some stuff that can help with it, but. <laughs> I want at least two pieces of the set. That way I can have a little bit of resistance. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping it was gonna tell me what it, would, it was doing for me. 
That'll get me up to fifteen hundred. <laughs> Just sell this stuff because I really don't need it. I can sell some of my Milo armor. That should go for a pretty high price. Yeah, 125. Pretty good. <laughs> should be going. Sure. Oh, I guess I'm just gonna take the headband then. Okay, so... Oh, okay, that's useful. So, I actually just need those two pieces and I can wear my phantom chest plate when I'm not... I can wear that when I'm not in here. I can wear the phantom chest plate. Okay, let's go talk to our lady Riju. Also, the reason why my... Oh. Um, video went black earlier is because when I was deactivating my camera, I accidentally deactivated the HDMI. Mm -hmm. Yet another traveler. How did you get in here? Oh, seems you have something rather interesting there. Called a Sheikah light. Also, I ran it. Your guards weren't that good at guarding. Oh. My name's Link, and I found oh. Omnivorous. Oh. Yes, I do. Hmm. Hmm. Yes, yes. Mm. Oh? Yeah, yeah, I'm a <laughs> bail. Huh? Hmm. Hmm. Yes, yes, I know. Mm. Going to go grab your thunder help from the Yiga. Oh. Even though it's very boring. Mm. Okay, okay, just get rid of this chat dialogue. It's the most boring thing uh, if you already know exactly what they say. Okay, yeah, I need to talk to you. I need to know where the Eagle Clan is. Yes, one of your people were, went missing there. It's been part of your unit. Oh, by the way, I defeated El Azolfo on my way here in the last video, so now I have three <laughs> knight bows. My 15 arrows for him. Okay, I'm gonna go purchase a sand seal on the other side of this. If I can climb the wall. Uh, you can't climb it if there's the window there. That's odd. I don't know why I paused on it's just always fun to do that. Also, that guy scammed us. 180, 180, and 180. We paid him... 600, and that stuff is only 540. So, well, it's only an extra 60, so it's not that bad, I guess. Let's seal the deal. Yeah, it's some weird kind of slang. I don't understand it. Okay, and I will see you guys when we get to the Yiga Village. Yiga Hideout. Okay, and we're here at the Yiga Hideout. Wow, I did not think you could actually carry arrows. Where is this guy? I 
don't want you to break that. Dang it! Stop teleporting! Nuisance. Shouldn't be too much further and then we get to the Yiga hideout. Well, might as well delete these markers right here. Never going here. You know, I'm not gonna do the DLC. I mean, it's everybody's already seen it, and I'm just gonna do Ganon. on. Probably grab the Hylian shield and then do Ganon. You know what? I'm just gonna run it. I set my travel medallion to go buy stealth armor. Yep, I'm gonna go buy stealth armor really quick. I will see you guys when I bought that stealth armor. Okay, and I'm on my way back to the Yuga clan. I practically sold everything in my inventory that I didn't need. To buy stealth armor because... I'm just gonna be honest, I suck at stealth missions. I am the worst that of the worst. At stealth. So. Not exactly going to be a walk in the park for me. Which is why I got this extra stuff. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, duplex. And I think I'm going to need the torch. Because I don't really have, um... Arrows to spare. I think this is it. Yep. First try. Will I have my sword ready for Koga? Um, probably, but I think I'm actually just gonna use the Rook's hammer for that. I'll use the sword for Naboris. First area done. And that has how you speed run the first part of the E Clan. And stock up on food. It's just pretty much the attack of Mother Load right here. Banana! Oh, it's this. I'll be more bananas. Bananas? No. We ain't all these chests wrong. And I just need to throw my mighty banana down. Yeah, as you can see, I... Far... Not exactly where I wanted. Yes. That is though. And that is that area done. And this should be my banana, hopefully. Yep. Now I'm just gonna grab these chests and kick Cope's butt. Oh, I finally was able to do the Yeek Clan first try. It usually never happens. 
This is my 17th completion of the year plan, because you have to do it twice in every game if you do DLC. Destroy Koga. Do I just want to skip this cutscene? That's a very big hole. I'm weak, and I'm going to destroy you. <laughs> I'll be back, everyone, in one second. Okay, I am back. You're Master Koga, <laughs> also known as the guy who gets killed a lot. <laughs> Because in Yiga Clan, if you're the boss of the Yiga Clan, you get the name Master Koga. If you're the Yiga Clan's right hand man, you name is Koga. No. I wish you're in the Thumbnation Falcon on the board. This is just sad to watch. And hilarious. You gonna throw on your tantrum? third phase. <laughs> that was very easy. I do. Well, you're not gonna let this stand. You're gonna fall. So you're gonna let this fall. No, that's a terrible pun. Pun, my bad. Oh, you're gonna roll your stuff into a hole with your own creation? Good thinking. Can you hurry that up? I have a video to record, buddy. This is the end of you. You can just see my hammer and the horns poking out there. Oh my. Yeah, the only leader of the Eagle Clan. And. Bye bye, you're dead. That sounded painful.
And here's the Thunder Home. I will see you guys at Gerudo Town, and I will also add a heart to link with the four spirit orbs I had. Okay, see you there. Okay, we were at Gerudo Town, and now I have ten hearts. And I know I said in the last episode I was going to power up my Master Sword, but that never happened. Because it's just kind of a waste of time, because everywhere I'll be doing the boss battles, it'll already get the power up. Okay, Riju, let's do this. Let's go kick that Divine Beast butt. Come on, let's hurry this up. Well, you certainly got here fast. I should have expected as much from the princess's own appointed knight. She was out on a survey all day today, still as the sand now. So, spill it, boy. Have the two of you been getting along all right? <laughs> it's okay, I know. Your silence speaks volumes. She gets frustrated every time she looks up and sees you carrying that sword on your back. It makes her feel like a failure when it comes to her own destiny. Don't worry, it's not like you carry blame in any of this. It's unfortunate. She's put in more than enough time. Ever since she was a young girl, she's gone through rigorous daily routines to show her dedication. She once passed out in the freezing waters trying to access this sealing power. And she has nothing to show for it. That's the motivation driving her research. I'd be doing the same thing. She really is quite special. You be sure to protect her with your life. It's quite the honor. The night brings a chill. It's probably time we take her in. Hmm. Or... <gasps> Abusa! What was that? Did you feel that? Wait, what? How did you... What are you doing here? <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> uh. And that was a another railway discovered. Oops. I don't know what I just pressed. I'm just spamming A and B pretty much. Of course, yes, I hope he was fond of Boris. <laughs> okay, I will see you guys when I am at Von de Boris's bomb shooting. Okay, oh. and now it's time to shoot into Boris up a bunch with bombs. So we can get inside. <laughs> I just need to change to my Phantom Chest Plate and Vow Gerudo Armor. So I think that has a little bit more protection. It has a protection on level of 14 instead of 3. Over here! Come 
gonna rejuvenate up your squad here. Not even dashing. is kind of slow. I probably should wait for Riju in the first one. Riju! Any time now! Keep it together! You're the one who didn't oh, turn for me! Left me to die. Don't fall behind. Don't stray. This is probably the hardest stage because. I'm trying to, because the player is trying to slow down for Riju, so myself, and then Riju is trying to slow down for you, so you always intertwine. And how about you stay close? Excuse me, disgrace on myself. Ow. I am very bad at this. Okay, so if I slow down to hit a circle, then you speed up. as well. Well, this is gonna be close. Okay, that was close. I will see you guys in the next one.